tonight on After Degrassi. Dallas and Allie get closer. Ooh. Cute though, we're just not there yet, Dallas. Tristan becomes the new teacher's pet. Call me Grant. And Claire can't handle her feelings for Drew. Just a crush, a really dumb one. But next week, Claire confesses it all. OMG! I'm confused, okay? And we're hosting. After Degrassi starts right now. What an episode. We've got science fairs, writing collectives, and a lot of crushes. Oh, and by the way, we're hosting the show. April Fools! <laughs> we like to welcome our Degrassi super fans, Lauren and Phoebe. Oh, yeah. Thank you for being here. <laughs> okay, so before we get to Degrassi, let's talk about the Kids' Choice Awards that just happened this weekend. Demo, Mindy, and Luke were there, and Looking they look good. so yeah, they all look so fabulous. Nice. Look hang so out in LA. Oh, oh my gosh! See, of their I didn't know weather. you called Demetrius Demo. So yeah, that's his nickname. Yeah. That's yeah, you guys can call him that, right? Also, okay. yeah, that's yeah. fine. That's fine. Also, did you guys notice Luke always wears that Louis Vuitton belt everywhere always, he goes? Always. Swag. I'll, I'll never know. Also, I he has different either. colors, gold and silver. Amazing. Is it a fashion no-no, or you guys are like, do you like it? No, he like just it? loves it. I, I'm almost sure that he has belt loops on his pajamas so that he can wear it to bed. Like, <laughs> He's at home right now. Are yes. you in your belt? You let us know on Twitter, please. I'm very much down for that belt, though. So. <laughs> Hope oh, watching. Shit. <laughs> okay, you guys ready to talk to Grassy? Always. Yes. Uh, tonight we were talking about the four moments that made us a drama. drama. At number four, Allie and Dallas get closer, but Jenna jumped in to tell Dallas to back off. Do you agree with Jenna? Well, Jenna's being super awkward, as you saw there. She's just like, don't like getting right in the way, like being all yeah. uppity about it. And it's like, you know, they like each other. You've talked about it with yeah. Allie before. Like, back off a little bit. I thought it was a bit aggressive. I feel like a friend like Jenna sometimes causes a little bit of drama sometimes. It's better to stay out of it, on my point of view. Yeah. Yeah, but at the same time, under normal circumstances, maybe. But I feel like with all the stuff that just happened with Leo, yeah. like, being overprotective is kind of a natural response. True. It's like super yeah. overprotective. Do you guys have friends like this? Mm. I feel like I have a friend or a friend or two that might pull me aside and remind me what my feelings are and what the situation is. Right. Sometimes I get lost in it. But I don't think I have a friend, like, I don't, I couldn't picture, like, Lauren jumping in between me and a guy being like, stop, you're not supposed <laughs> yeah. to flirt, you guy, yeah. you know. Yeah. I'd just be like, <laughs> make your own mistake. Yeah, you have <laughs> to almost, like, make your own mistakes to remember, like, the pain and remember, yeah. I'm with so, you no. on that one, Lauren. And didn't you love how Jenna just sort of acted like there was no chance Connor was going to win the science yeah, fair? Yeah, which I, I think yeah. science fair is Connor's game. Like, that's right. his thing. I thought he's probably won before. He's probably a shoe in this time around. It's funny, she kind of treats him like he's a baby. She's like, okay, Connor, <laughs> like, you're sure you're gonna win. Totally. I'm kind of totally. rooting for Allie, though. I feel like if she wins this thing, she can, like, focus 100% back on science yeah. and forget about she everything deserves that's it. kind of happened to her she, recently. She totally deserves yeah. it. She can get back to, you know, trying to cure breast cancer. Right. Yeah. Right. She is so smart, but she's also going to be so distracted by Dallas being late or not showing up that she's going to just blow it. Probably. Totally. Uh, they're science partners in crime. We'll see, like we'll see. Too. But tonight at number three, Tristan pushes his way into the secret group. If you guys were Zoe, would you tell Tristan where the secret meeting was? No. Well, no, I'd be like, no. I got my invite. What about you guys? No. 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 no, exactly. You got your invite fair and square. It's like, if she gives that information out, it's risking her chances. She might get kicked out. Okay. I would, I would you have? What? Well, I have a huge problem with this Mr. Yates and how snobby he is. How hot he is. Ooh. No, he's so <laughs> snobby. Like, in school, you shouldn't have a secret club that's all elitist and crap, making people feel like they're not as cool as everybody else. That is so stupid. That's I'm yeah. Yeah. Oh, you got a <laughs> They're not even meeting at the school. They're meeting in a forest. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Yeah. It's a little weird. Like, we get it. You're unconventional. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I would but can a teacher and student be friends? Are you guys down for that? No, I don't think you're supposed... I mean, I wouldn't say I've never done it. No, I'm kidding. Oh. But I, I don't know. I, I don't think it's as bad as people think. You like who you like. But don't you think this is, this is like, super inappropriate? He's driving him to well, the dentist. Just, yeah, and oh. you can call me grand, and you might be my new favorite student. Like, those things, yes. they just met. It's farther like, than they being just friends. Like, yeah. I think the teacher, I you think, think Mr. Yates... You think you know, because you know things that we don't know. <laughs> don't I, say! 
<laughs> you can see it all over. He's like googly eyes for Tristan and like. But Tristan's yeah. googly eyes back. He's like, oh, hey, Mr. Well, he's, well, you know what's happening, and I don't like it because teachers are supposed to be in the like proper position, and he's taking advantage of this naive kid, yeah. Tristan, and he's not even going to see it through coming. A, parents are maybe going through a divorce. And he just wants so attention. Like, oh, you're vulnerable. Well, have you guys ever been into a teacher? Mr. Not Woodman, me. Mr. Enns, Mr. Yes. Castles, <laughs> yes. Mr. Or our buddy. Me too. Can I say it might embarrass him, but Mr. Ow, you were cute. Oh, oh God. God. I used to call you Mr. Ow, Ow, in school. <laughs> That's Maybe he's watching. I don't know. Oh my gosh. It's, it's so like as long as it's a crush and it's innocent, fine. But yeah, as soon totally. as you cross that line, it's like. As soon yeah. as you get into the car with him, it's not. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely true. <laughs> okay, so tonight at number two, Connor and Dallas had to deal with some serious stuff this week. Do you think Dallas was overreacting? Hmm. No. No. no I, agree uh, the with I don't think so. The audience is always right on it. No. It's yeah, true. Like he's not. he's really mad and really angry about it, as he should be. It's just kind of like a bad situation to be in because what are you supposed to do? And like, I think we all feel how helpless yeah, he right, is right totally. now. So I just, I just don't know what he's supposed to do. How's he supposed totally. to fight that? Yeah. yeah. It was, it was a really tough storyline for us to discuss and, and read about in our read through. And I, I remember being very personally angry because, um, it's, so frustrating to know this actually happens yeah. every day. Now um, it's 2014, man. Yeah, like, and, and even during it. the read through, AJ and Demo, who we know and love, um, shared stories of this happening in their real lives too. And yeah. it's so hard to know that there are strangers out there who judge these wonderful, kind guys that we know and judge them differently just because right. they don't know them. Very and I, confusing. Yeah. Yeah, very confusing. But tonight at number one, Claire gets her feelings for Drew in check. She can't get them in check. What advice would you give to Claire? I think chill oh. out. <laughs> I think I think she's. In a, I think her and Maya should hang out because they're both in this situation where they have too many guys. The they can't decide what guy they want. And it's like it's frustrating. Like I've been seeing guys, and I'm like, oh, but I wish you had this quality of this so, guy and this. Are you saying this has happened to you? I'm saying this is like every. <laughs> Oh guy of ever dated, I've been like, oh, but you could be this and this and this. Like, we need, I said it last week, we need like a human blender where but we can Claire's just put the Lauren? in there. Lauren? I, this, no, I have one choice, I go for it. But Claire, yeah, but to, her boyfriend's like, Claire, on point. Claire so. needs to calm down though because she's over dramatizing the whole thing. Like, I, it's defending yes. No, no? I, I completely agree with Lauren. I think Claire should just take a cold shower and yeah. get over it. Yeah. So I also <laughs> want to point out uh, this moment because we're both here. Okay. Besides, it's not like Drew would ever actually date you. And why is that? Because you're not his type. Like, at all. E Ooh. Do you guys think Imogen was overstepping? It was out of. Yeah. <gasps> guys. It was, it was no. out of character. I was like, Imogen, like, yeah. that's not like her to yeah. say something like that. A She's little, always accepting and... A little but, bit of a mean girl moment, personally. I don't know. But you're defending your friend, like, your best friend, Eli, which no one That's spoke true. on behalf of him yet. Claire's forgotten about him for yeah. a minute. <laughs> so it's like, I like that you were that you know, defensive about it and, and protecting Eli in this case. And maybe that's where mm. that came from, that little snap, like, don't you dare hurt my friend. Very true, mm -hmm. yeah. very true. Yeah, I think that's true. Uh, Phoebe and Lauren are sticking around after the break because we're doing some social media. Oh, okay. the after Degrassi couch. So now it's your turn, ladies. Oh, Let's do some MPB uh, creeping. I, dun, dun, dun. Oh, I pull a lot of things up. <laughs> so, Phoebe, you were first. Oh, gosh. <clears throat> I'm never going to creep you guys again. You tweeted, Oh no. going to Google image my crush, <laughs> pick my fave photo, make it full screen, Literally. put my laptop on an empty pillow next to mine so I'll wake up to him. <laughs> um, would you like to tell us who that is? My yesterday was like, I think you need to be more careful with what you're tweeting. First of all, because I'm like, I want a boyfriend. She's like, that tweet just scared away every guy. Um, I'm Tell like, us well, right now. Yeah, you're avoiding the question. That's um, what's happening. Well, I was just going to say, it's like, it's about manifesting. If you do that, you can manifest She's avoiding telling us who it is. Lauren, do you know? I'm not saying because everyone knows who he is, and then they'll tweet him. <laughs> oh, come really on. Our first time I'll posting. give you a hint. Okay, that was a joke, but I'll say that he has been on Degrassi as a guest. Oh, so anyway, that's a good oh, question. Nice question. Okay. Now the, now the 
tweets are Take funny. Yeah. Because I did some tweets. But the creepy thing was a joke. I didn't really put a computer there. <laughs> I had the picture printed off and it was on the wall pasted. Okay, we want okay, you guys to tweet your guesses about this. Yeah, this tweet is your guesses. Oh, hashtag after Degrassi. Um, Lauren, we found one of your tweets. Uh, it read, what else oh. is there left to see in pop music? Oh, right. The vagina. <laughs> Tweet. How did you find that? We creeped really hard. What do you mean by this? So when Lady Gaga performed somewhere, I think she was in a gay nightclub, she fully stripped and like had flashed everyone her <laughs> vagina. And it was like, really? Like, do we really need to do this? Oh goodness. And Here, there's nothing left, to. there's nothing left to see if you like, you know what I mean? Like she's left nothing to the imagination. And I'm like a Gaga fan, but that just put it over the top for me where I was like, okay, I'm gonna Yeah. I'm just gonna Why make fun of it that? instead of that's old. I don't even know how you find old tweets because you, you know when you scroll and scroll and scroll, like they're right. gone almost. Well, we got gotcha. you. Don't tweet enough. Good job. <laughs> well, I certainly don't tweet as much as you. Happy <laughs> okay, extra. Speaking of, uh, we have another photo that you tweeted, Phoebe. Oh, um, and it's no, but it's actually really nice, and I'd love to know what it means to you. Oh, I never was changed. That on my I app just learned. Mind, body, spirit. Yes, Instagram. It was, yeah. <laughs> I never changed. I just learned. Um, Sometimes I think I change all the time. Like my appearance changes all the time. I change, like my personality changes, and I grow. And and I think people are like, oh, why do you look different now? And like, why do you act different now? But I think it's like, it's important in life to just let kind of that happen and grow and like, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, I love you know, that. Still the same core. Love like, that. I'm still Phoebe forever. Thing. I just have blonde hair, and I'm like, I'll, I know a little bit yeah. more now. I don't know. Love it's that, it's okay Phoebe. to grow. You Thank don't have you. to stay yourself. Just, I don't know, and life's totally. a journey, man. Life's, okay. life's a journeyman, okay? What all right, <laughs> all right, guys. <laughs> okay. Life's judgmental. We love it. I yeah. Yeah. Like, all, right. <laughs> all right, guys, they're sticking around because after the break, we're doing a Degrassi spelling bee. Oh. This is so This is going to be good. spell a word if the contestant spells the word incorrectly a bell will sound and they will be out of the competition if they spell the word correctly no bell will sound and the contestant will remain in the competition we will continue to play until there is only one winner unless we run out of time and there will be a joint winner isn't that awesome remember uh, remember uh no talking will be allowed uh, among the contestants or between contestants and the members of the audience yeah you gotta be quiet today quiet please uh let's play degrassi spelling bee okay here we go all right, guys, I would like to have uh, contestant number one. Please stand. You look lovely, young lady. Good luck, Ace. Thank That's you. Great. Uh, your word. <laughs> yeah. Your word is interrogation. <gasps> okay. <laughs> oh, no, I'm so nervous. I'm shaking. Oh, my God, first word, and I'm already unsure. Okay, um, I N T E R R O. Uh, G A T I O N. That is correct. Oh my God. I mean, this is a Contestant number two, why'd you come up to the mic? What a lo you're lovely as well. Oh, thanks. There you go. Uh, your word is gnarly. Gnarly. Oh, that's so easy. What? G N A R L Y, gnarly. That is correct. <laughs> Hello, contestant number three. Is there autocorrect? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just give it a shot, okay? Okay. Here we go. Your word is infamous. Infamous. I N F A M O U S. Infamous. You are correct. <laughs> Contestant number four. Hi, how you doing? Come on, don't be shy. Don't be shy. Get I'm up there. I'm not shy, but not I'm at nervous. all. Anyone got a dictionary? Contestant number four. Your word is humiliation. <laughs> yeah, like right now. Um, <laughs> H-U-M <laughs> I-L I-A T-I-O-N You are correct. <laughs> Very nice. That one got past the first round. Here you know, we go. Like now. cheating. It's not a writing game. Oh, I think that's a lot. I think that's what you do. I think that's what you do. I'm these guys. Okay. Round two. Here we go. Sorry, Here we go. Contestant yes, number one. Ready. Your word is photosynthesis. <laughs> Just write it on your hand, Aeson. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Um, F O. No! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Oh, contestant oh, 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 number one, oh, I'm sorry! No. You are now disqualified from the contest. I'm sorry. Give her I'm so That's a major upset happening right now. Uh, contestant number two. Hello. Two. Your word is menstruation. Menstruation? <laughs> Are you serious? Your word is menstruation. M E N S T R U T R A T I O N. Menstruation. <gasps> oh, menstru <laughs> menstruation. Yes. No. There was. You missed. Uh, it was uh, uh, R U A T I O N. Menstruation. Yeah. Wait, so did you get it right or did you not? I thought I got. Right. Uh -oh. You got it right. Ding means you got it wrong, doesn't it? I think Ding got wait. M E N. You got it wrong. Sorry, sucker. Okay. okay I appreciate right. it. All right, here yeah, we go. It's okay. down to us. Can it's you down to you it? two right now. This is not supposed to happen. Contestant number three. <laughs> Inconceivable. 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 I N C O N C O N C O N C O N S E I B L E. That no. is incorrect. It's incorrect? Yes, it's I N C O N C E I V A B L E. Wait, inconceivable. What would you think I was saying? I don't know. <laughs> Wait. I don't know. Does that mean I win by default? Um, I just win because yeah, I have to win. Yeah, you just I don't think that's the case. Here's the your time. word. Nope, here's your word. You have to spell it oh. right. Uh, your word is eavesdrop. Yeah, okay. <laughs> e. A V. E S D R O P. That's correct. <laughs> wait, wait. Another round. Small menstruation. Oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, oh my God. God! I'd like to thank my mom for uh, <laughs> teaching me to spell. Um, I'd like to thank uh, all my competitors. Because you were really great competitors. Amazing. Okay, so we are just checking in with the Degrassi cast oh who's hanging out in the rubber room. Watch this. <laughs> oh, well done. I thought I got to put this on since oh. yes, you're number one. Okay, thanks, Steph and Broden, for hosting this. Please come back anytime. You're a fabulous game show host. And uh, I like being a guest. How about you? She's too distracted by her <laughs> mini trophy. No, I'm excited for next week. I like hosting better. Okay, well, really? There's no I, creeping involved. I didn't mind it. Okay, <laughs> Mindy is here next week, and we'll confirm oh. our guests on Twitter as well. So follow us at After Degrassi, and tickets are free. So go to mtv.ca slash Degrassi for tickets. Thank you, Christine and Ace. Thank you. questions I answered. I am over Bianca. I know. And I don't get you. First you want me to get a girlfriend, then, then you find me a girl. And then you go out of your way to sabotage this whole thing that, that you set up. I'm confused, okay? 